Hey everybody, uh, welcome to day one of Operation Open Fire and today I've relocated to my old uh, room upstairs in the house um, that is currently I guess my storage room while I slowly make my way down to the basement to bring all my stuff down but I'm um, up here so I can show you uh, two of my other hobbies that are um, uh, not a hobby, well not um, not miniature related, not painting related. But anyway, let's start off with my progress so far. Um, so last night, I managed to get um, the bases, the uh, the wood, um, and the backpacks and webbing um, done on every, all the Americans. Um, so well, they're on their way. Uh, either tonight or tomorrow night, I should have uh, all the other colors put on and then the wash. So it might actually happen tonight. It's pretty early today. Uh, everyone's gone down. Um, oh, happy Canada Day, everybody. Um, for those of you in Canada, um, the rest of you that are having your Independence Days and your uh, birth, uh, country's birthdays, uh, yours is coming up, so i give you a happy birthday then, but for now, happy Canada Day. So anyway, so that's where I'm at now. Um, these guys are coming out pretty well. So yeah, like I said, either by tomorrow night or by the day after, these guys will be done and I can move on to the Germans. Anyway, I gotta excuse the mess. So I want to talk about my other two hobbies. So my my oldest hobby um, that I that I currently continue with is uh, collecting one six scale figures. So here's Jabba. There's Han and Carbonite there, and there's um, there's the uh, the Cantina band, the modal nodes. And this is about uh, probably uh, less than half of my collection. Probably about a third of my collection. The rest are in uh, a couple bins as I was trying to move them around, but I have mostly Star Wars, um, but I do have quite a few uh, G.I. Joe, so here's like uh, G.I. Joe, G.I. Joe, real American hero stuff. There's Cobra on his throne. Um, there's Emperor on his throne. Um, yeah, I've got, I've got a lot, and um, I can talk about these another time, and I probably will, but these are an expensive hobby for sure, very expensive hobby. Each guy here is... Um, generally over a hundred bucks, probably 150 or, or more. Some of them are a bit uh, less. I, I've bought them for, but uh, for the most part, you know, over a hundred. Uh, don't even ask how much Jabba and his throne were. That's just hundreds of dollars. I didn't want to know how much money I have on this shelf alone, and that's not even everybody. So anyway, eventually these guys are going to move downstairs with me, and we'll have to find a nice way to to uh, display them. Um, they're just too many to display, uh, you know on here. If this is a third, just imagine how much space I need. That's two of these IKEA Expedit shelves, the 4x4 Expedit shelves, and uh, they hardly fit up top. Oh, and that's including another couple floating shelves to hold some more. Anyway, my other hobby is uh, board gaming, uh, generally. Also card games and war games and stuff like that, but um, this is the ma majority of my games, and there's a, a bunch behind these here. Um, yeah, I've been playing games since 2005 um, regularly. Before that, you know, I dabbled, but um, that's when I really got into gaming, and uh, this is the majority of my collection. Some of it is uh, downstairs as well. See, I've got some some hidden back there, too. Um, most of these shelves are filled with games. I play every kind of game that I possibly can. Since I've uh, had kids, of course, my gaming has gone way down. Um, one of my goals for this year was to just play as much more as I could. Um, you know, some months I'm playing like eight games a month, and that includes like quick card games, so that's really sad, but you know, I used to get up to 92, I think 92 is my my highest n number of games played in a month. That was, that was before getting married, before having kids, so it's gone down. I still enjoy it as much as I can. Um, you know, I'm part of a, a kind of part of a few groups here in Toronto, gaming groups, but I don't really get a chance to go out too much these days it's about you know people coming over or me going to someone's house usually it's like a two two player games in the last little while but I love me some some board games so yeah those are my two hobbies one six scale miniatures and uh, and board gaming and uh, it's interesting because they both kind of relate to miniature gaming because these are miniature guys well not too small but mini these are figures and gaming are games and when I play my minis games, yep, it's kind of like these and these together. So, that's that. Um, so there's day one. Um, hope everyone else is, is getting along with their painting. Uh, I had my head start, so I'm, I'm well on my way. 
um, yeah, tomorrow's another day. We'll see uh, see where I get tomorrow. Hopefully I can get those Americans done tonight and um, show those guys off. All right, have a good night. Later, everybody.